Hello ladies and gentlemen, Adrian here from the Distril team. Today we're going to be taking a look at how you can use Distril to create bootable disks on Mac OS. It starts off by you going to the top left here and choosing to create a boot drive. In this case we're looking to create an OS X or Mac OS installer. Now this will give you the initial instructions. You need at least an 8 gigabyte plus USB drive. And then from there you basically will locate the installer that you're choosing to use, whether it's manually or downloading the latest version from the App Store choosing the destination drive, and then from there, you simply have a ready-to-go bootable drive. Now, this is super useful in the event that you need an emergency Mac OS bootable USB. For example, let's say you have a computer or Mac that has been corrupted or has some hard drive issues and you need to reinstall the OS and you can't you know, reformat it or have any other issues. Well, with a bootable drive like this, you can create a Mac OS installer so that you can easily get in to reinstalling the operating system or using the utilities to troubleshoot what issues may occur. So from here, let's go ahead and hit OK, let's do it. From there, you can see it automatically detected that I have Mac OS Sierra installed on this computer. However, if it's not detected, you can either A, choose to manually download it from the App Store here, or B, you can go ahead and locate the installer on the disk. So maybe you have another Mac OS or Mac OS 10 version on your hard drive, you can manually search for that. Otherwise, you simply choose to use the detected OS as the source. Now from there, you're going to go ahead and plug in a USB, keeping in mind that all the data will be wiped from this. And from there, you simply prep it, click Next, and the process will begin to make that a USB bootable drive. After that process is complete, you now have a Mac OS bootable drive, and you can use this by plugging into any Mac of your choice that you need to access, or again, if you have any corruption issues and you want to reinstall, Simply hold the Alt or Option key at boot, and you'll be presented with multiple devices you can boot from, one of those including your USB that you just created. And it's that simple and that easy with Distro.